Hello once again everyone, welcome back to the Paper Mario Blind Let's Play! We are in the second episode and it's... Uh, blah, blah, I, <laughs> I really tried there for an intro. So, yes, let me try that again. Hello once again everyone, uh, we're back in Paper Mario. Last time, we uh, went to the castle of Peach. Bowser attacked the castle um, with this new star rod power that he has. Thus destroying me, Mr. Mario, and causing the the castle to be risen up onto his spaceship. We were knocked out, sent to the Goomba village, and then we fought... Oh, what's his face? Thingy Junior? Thingy? A little, um... A little egg person. Um, we managed to retrieve the hammer, and now we are going to continue our journey by smashing this block here. Aha. Uh -huh. And, ooh. Oh, it heals us. If you hit this block, your HP, heart points, will fully recover. Ah, oh, that's clever. I like that. Oh, look at that. Look at Mario when I hit this. He does like a little shiver because it's too hard for him to break. I assume we're going to get a powered up hammer at some point. Oh, look at those texture glitches right there. Oh, tasty. Oh, boing. What's this? You got the fire flower. A flower that burns all enemies with fireballs. Attack power 3. You got an item. You'll use items in this game to attack enemies, to recover your HP, and to do a few other things. Press left on the C pad to see what items Mario has now. Oh, okay. That's a fire flower. Nice and snazzy. Nice and snazzy. I like it. Heads up, Mario. I see bad Goombas ahead. They're loyal to Bowser. If they see you, they'll attack you without hesitation. If you can successfully attack an enemy in the field with jump or ammo, you'll get the first strike when you'll enter the battle. Striking first really helps when it comes to battling. Okay. Oh, look, there's a revive from Pokemon up there. Oh, no. I didn't manage to do it. Items, fire flower. Will it... I'm betting this is a one-use thing, but I might as well try. Oh, that is cool! Two star points! Yeah! Uh, it looks like we don't have any more items. Okay, we used up that fire flower. That is okay. Shazoom! Oh, that's cool, the music changed. This is a spike goomba. See the spike on his head? Be careful not to jump on him. You'll definitely get hurt. I assumed as much, so we're going to have to hit this dude with a hammer then. I feel bad for wasting that fire flower now. I probably shouldn't have done that. Boink, boink. Oh, it's a flying Goomba. Okay. Oh, I got the first strike in him. Awesome. Ah, there's two of them. Listen up, Mario. The enemy's flying. Your ammo won't reach enemies in the air. To attack airborne enemies, use a jump attack. You can jump over one enemy to attack one behind it, too. This is good advice. Jump over one enemy. Does that mean I can jump... Okay, no, I thought it meant I could uh, jump over that and attack. I took that wrong. So I'm going to have to jump in the power Goomba. Remove his wings. And then I can smash him with a hammer. I love the little animations for this. It's beautiful. I'm never going to stop loving like the art style of this game. Okay, so... We can't jump on spiked enemies' heads, and we can't hammer enemies in the air. That makes sense. And so if I get first strike on these Goombas, that means I'm not taking any damage in the combat, and that's really, really good. Boink, up here. Hit this tree. A coin falls out. And we're going to get this thing that looks like a revive. You got the star piece! 
It's a glowing star piece. Wait and see what this is for. Oh, okay. <laughs> Oh, his hat does a little flutter when he jumps. I am so in love with this game. Never worry, young kids. Here I am. Thanks to young Mario here, I made it back all right. Oh, no, it's just a sign. Oh, is that thing locked? Let me open up for you. Not entirely sure how, because I don't have hands. Goodbye. Where have you been? I looked outside. Wow, both you and the veranda were just plain gone. Gumpa, I was very, very worried about you. Really worried. Sorry, kids. I apologize. I didn't mean to make you fret. You just take it easy now. I'm back safe and sound. Eh, eh. I'm an old Gumpa. <laughs> now, before I forget, I've decided to give you something, Mario. Wait here a minute. Inside he goes. Huh? Hey, that doll you got, that's the one Goobaria lost. She was looking all over for it. Would you give it back to her? Yes, I will. That's my dolly! Dolly, dolly, you're back! Thank you so much! I'm so happy. It's my sweet dolly. Don't you ever get lost again? Here's a present from me. Look at the pretty glitter. You got a star piece. Awesome. And take this, too. <laughs> Just give him a little smooch on the cheek. You always seem to beat up your enemies. Do you work out? I study self-defense by reading books by the masters but listening to Dad and Gumpa. Also, I exercise every day so I can be strong, like you. It's starting to show. Look, I'm getting big muscles. Yeah, Gumpario's head is hard as a rock now. Tee hee. When he, when he does his head bonk. <laughs> it's called a head bonk. That is so cute. Head bonk move. It really, really hurts. Be quiet, Gumbaria. You're embarrassing me. Of course, it is true. Sorry to have kept you waiting, Mario. It's okay, Gumpa. We're just wrapping up. We're just wrapping with Mario. Oh my god. Oh, wrapping, huh? Sorry. Wanted to give this to Mario. Their voices are changing all the time. You got the power jump badge. Mario stomps on a single enemy using a lot of attack power. Badge, okay. This is called a badge. If you wear this, you'll be able to do a power jump, which means you'll be able to do a lot more damage when you jump attack. But listen here, and listen well. You'll only be able to do it if you're wearing that badge, capiche? <laughs> you... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you better try it first. Putting badges on and taking them off is a vital skill. Would you like a quick lesson on how to use your badges you collect during your travels? Yes, I would, Gimpa. Then, press start, and the menu will open. Okay. Now use a, how you put on and take off your badges. Use the control stick to point at the badge tab. Press A to enter the badge screen. Press A again to go to the list of all badges. Wearing badges off takes HP points. This one, no, it takes badge points. This one takes 1 BP. So I put the badge with A. The badge is now on. Press the A button again to take it off. The badge is now off, and one BP is returned to your total. Okay. Now remember, you need FP flower points to use the power jump technique. Do you remember that we saw a block like this on the way back to village? Well, these blocks will restore not only HP, but FP. They're lifesavers, Mario. Use them whenever your HP and FP reserves are getting low. By the by, Mario, I heard from Guma. You're taking it upon yourself to try and rescue the princess from Bowser's clutches? Oh yeah, Mario can beat Bowser with one hand tied behind his back. Hush now, Goombario. Mario, please take this hammer. It should serve you well. <laughs> if I were a bit, just a bit younger, I'd accompany you on your trip. I'd have done some damage. The years have started away on me, Lo. Uh, I'll tell you this, lower back pain. Oh, it's, it hurts so much. Adventure, you're so lucky. Princess rescued is so cool. I really want to be an adventurer too someday. Me too. Oh, here's an idea. Gumbario. Perhaps the timing is perfect. You are no longer a child, and evil times are upon us. I'm sure Mario will agree. You should accompany Mario. What? Really? M may I go, Goomba? May I really go? Yeah! Oh, yeah! Mario, you won't regret this! Gumbario has joined our party.
Press down on the C-pad to have him tell you about, de- about people, places or things nearby. When you're interested, just ask him. Gumbario is also helpful during battles. He can attack with head bonk or he can tell you about an enemy's features and HP using his tassel ability. Way to go, Gumbario! Mario, I know Gumbario would prove to be a worthy companion. Well, I think it's about time for my nap. I'll be in the house. Goodbyes! I have a, a way of making this old Goomba get weepy. This is so cool, Mario! Let's go! But wait, your HP looks a little low. Maybe you ought to take a rest at the Toad House. So we now have Goombario here. This is Goomba Village. The big tree near my house is a great place to get goom nuts. Okay. We'll have to see what those are. Uh, so let's put on this power jump badge. Uh, that's a party member there. Is there a... Hey, look, it's, uh... It's the big boy. So let's go in here, rest up slightly. Yeah, let's take a quick nap. Oh, that is brilliant. Yeah, we did sleep well. Thank you, Toad. Boing. Okay, so... Dad, did you hear? I'm going on an adventure with Mario. I'll make you proud, Dad. I swear it. Just wait. Do your best, son. I know you're grown a strong boy, and uh, you'll be a great help. It's a good thing you spent so much time training, huh? No, do your old papa proud. <laughs> Their voices keep changing, but you know what? It's fine. There we go. Problem solved. I have the feeling your rub will be lined with devil goodies, so try not overdo it. Be watchful, yet stay cool. A calm mind is the wisest. Smack that and get a goom nut. They restore 3 FP. Okay, so probably can only get... I wonder if I can go back into the area and refresh it. Yes, I can. I can farm them. Not gonna, though. Beware of Goombas. Oh, God. <laughs> hey, Mario. During a battle, you can change the order we attack in with Z. I can attack first if you want. I don't mind at all. Just keep it in mind, okay? I'm going to do a head bonk first. Oh. Noises? Oh, someone is... Someone's hammering in the flat above me. I really hope the mic doesn't pick that up. What were those? BAM! Oh no, I didn't do it. Let me... Jump on you. And then Goomba, no, Goombario is going to do a head bonk there. And we're just going to do another head bonk. So Goombas have 2 HP. And if we hit them first, we take off 1 HP of them. So that means what I can do is I can do a head bonk on you. Then I will use Mario's power jump. Take you out. Simple. Yeah. Awesome. And we recovered some health. Oh. Come on. Yeah, I got the first strike. Sweet. So I'm going to have to power jump uh, the second Goomba there. If only got... Mm, no, probably not. It's okay if we take a bit of damage. A bit of damage. Sorry, I'm not articulating well today. 
So my, um... Last episode, I said that there is, uh, sort of the... I'm pretty sure there's a power jump feature, or like, if you time your hit right, you can do more damage. Uh, my, um... My Paper Mario informant has told me that this is the case. Uh, I'm gonna have to hit you with a hammer because otherwise Goombario is gonna take some damage. So I can't wait till we find out how to do that because that was one of my favorite things about playing uh, Mario and Luigi Inside Story. It was just that feeling of like the power hit was really, really fun to do. Sorry if you can hear like the sloshing of water, I've got a big bottle of water beside me to keep myself hydrated. Stay hydrated, kids. It's the best thing you can do. What's that? You got the close call badge. When Mario's in danger, enemies sometimes fail to attack. Ooh, that sounds good. Okay. Well, we're definitely going to put this badge on. Eat a mushroom to regain your energy. When HP gets low, eat a mushroom with left. You got the mushroom. It restores 8, 5 HP. Haha. <laughs> Take that. I'm gonna jump on you. And then Goombario is gonna give a little whack on his head there. A little noggin attack. The animations for this is gorgeous, like it looks like it would be a modern sort of DS game. Yes, um, if you like sort of smoothed out the edges, this would be an awesome game to have on the DS. Why have they have they remade Paper Mario for for 3DS? If they ha if they haven't, like Nintendo seriously need to get on that. We need some. I, I would love to be able to play this portably. Well, I can. I've got you know. You can run it on a laptop via emulators. But you know what this. This would be awesome to have as a 3DS title because you could really do like the what's the the periscopic 3D with the 3D slider thing. You could definitely do that um, with the, the battle scenes. That would look really really cool. Hold on. <clears throat> hey hey, hold it right there, you yeah you suspicious guy. Don't move. Ah, uh, you're Mario. I knew it. You can't go past here, Mr. Big Shot. That's a direct order from Goomba King. That's right. I'm sorry, but the only way is through is the Goomba. Bye. I'm sorry, but the only way by is through the Goomba brothers. That's me, Red Goomba, and my brother, Blue Goomba. Let's get him, Blue Goomba! Oh yeah, let's we'll do it, my Red brother. Boss battle time. I'm gonna do a power jump on... Red Goomba looks more dangerous. And then we're gonna get the tattle ability. See what that does. This is Red Goomba. He's the older of the two notorious Goomba brothers. Max HP seven, attack power one, defense power zero. The Goomba King ordered him to try and stop you. You can take this guy, no prop. He has just a little more HP than an ordinary Goomba. Mario, how'd you like some of this? Okay, so they probably do both do one HP. Oh, cool! We see the HP bars there. I'm gonna use that on you, and I'm gonna use the tattle ability on Blue Goomba. This is Blue Goomba. He's the younger of the two notorious Goomba brothers. Max HP six, attack power one, defense power zero. As you heard in his little speech, he's one of the Goomba King's men. He doesn't look that healthy. He's weaker than his brother. Okay, that is really, really cool. I'm loving how it's not just, like, how Libra is. Is it Libra? Libra is in Final Fantasy where it just shows all their stats. It's like, Gumbario gives you, like, almost a little bit of lore to it. That is really, really cool. I'm liking that. We're going to get rid of Blue Goomba first. If we focus down on the one target, we should be able to do, a f like, be a bit more efficient. Okay, we're in danger here, but that's okay because we can finish off Blue Goomba. Blue! Blue Goomba! Ah, my little brother! You'll pay for that, Mario! And then what we can do is we can... We should be able... Oh, he missed! Because of our badge, that's awesome. Um...
I should be able to survive. So I'm just going to do a jump attack. Unless critical hits are a thing, we should be fine for this battle. And he misses again, that's fab. We're going to jump attack this, finish it how Goombas should be finished. By jumping on their head. 20 star points, nice! Yeah! Oh, I'll let you go for now. I'm sorry if you can hear, like, construction noises in the background. Right. Look, Mario, there's a save block. Might be a good idea to use it, don't you think? Oh, it's down there. Oh, cool! I didn't notice that. Right, what I'm going to do is, I'm actually going to use this mushroom. And then I'm going to use one of these goom nuts. And then we're going to hit this save block. Save completed. Eat a mushroom to gain your energy. Oh no! How very dare you. Could take it out with a power jump, but I'm not feeling it. Yeah, you can sort of feel it in the animations that there's a moment where you can sort of like press a button to interfere with it. We're close to leveling up. It's 100 star points, I believe, isn't it? To level up. He says rhetorically. Goomba King's Fortress ahead. Okay, Goomba, help us! Mario beat us up! Hey look, Mario! See that building over there? I'm pretty sure there used to be a bridge on the other side. I wonder what happened to it. Oh. Oh dear. <laughs> so, Mario, it's true. You've made it this far. I respect you for that. Unfortunately, this is as far as you'll ever get, because I, the great and powerful King Goomba, will see to it that you advance no further. You weren't that, Mario. No further. Not one step. Are you scared, little man? <laughs> yeah, you're scared, all right. You want to say you're sorry? Wow, that King Goomba is really huge. I'm sure he's no match for you, though, Mario. Let's get him. Ready to meet my wrath, Mario? You would better be. Oh, well, I'm not ready. Beat him up, King Goomba. Yeah, we got your back. Leave him to me. Hey, Mario. I think maybe we ought to take out Goomba Bros first, don't you think? They must be pretty weak since we just finished beating them up back there. That's a really, really good point. Wait. Okay, we can see their health. So, if we beat him up... Then what? Tattle ability on King Goomba. Oh dear, okay. Okay, we're already at half health. That is worrying. I'm gonna power jump Blue Goomba just to get him out of the way. <clears throat> and then I'm gonna tattle ability on King Goomba. This is the Goomba King! He's really big! I, I mean, look at him! He looks really powerful! Max HP 10, power attack 1, defense power 0. He's the boss of the red Goomba and the blue Goomba. Who cares if he's stronger? You're much stronger! Gee, I wonder what he had to become so big! I I'd like to be a bit bigger, though. Okay... Okay, that was good. He missed us. So, we are going to power jump first. Then we're going to head bonk. I'm a little bit worried that we're already in danger. If I eat a Goomnut, will I get a turn as well? I 
don't think I will. Yeah, that used my that used my turn. Okay, we should we should be able to do this. Ah, uh, no, I don't want that. I want power jump. And then we're gonna get another head bonk. We are dancing with death here. We're gonna jump and finish this off. Whoa! 30 star points! Level up! Oh! Max FP will go up with three. So we select one to upgrade. Hmm. That does go up to 15 points, which would be good. Max FP will go up by five. Oh, I don't know. I don't, you know what? I'm gonna go HP. Because HP is always handy. <laughs> How can I lose? Yeah, take that, King Goomba. Yeah, I know we could do it. Cool, victory. Woohoo! That was awesome. That was an amazing boss fight. Right, what we're gonna do, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna run back to that save block and end the episode here because I think that's a fantastic place to end it. Is that? Oh, okay, no, that's a. That's a creepy Goomba trying to trying to steal us, some kill us. Right, okay, so, ladies and gentlemen, this has been the second episode of the Paper Mario Blind Let's Play. If you have enjoyed this episode, please make sure to hit the like button. And if you aren't subscribed, please subscribe to keep up with this series. I'm having a blast playing Paper Mario. It's awesome. Uh, I'm enjoying it so much. If you've got any hints and tips about the game, please leave them down below. But keep them spoiler free because this is blind and I do not want to spoil anything for this game because I'm having so much fun already. But without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, we shall end the episode here. Goodbye and I will see you all in the next episode.